Okay, I'm going to call the meeting to order at 7.30. Uh, roll call, William Johnson. Here. Tom Graffinino. Here. Lynn Colligan. Here. Lisa Kreckler. Here. And Phil DiOrio is here. Um, the uh, first order of business, I'm going to review and approve the uh, January 24th, 2024 minutes. Uh, do I have a motion to approve the minutes? I'll make that motion. I'll second. All in favor? Aye. 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 All right, we have two applications tonight. The first is eight. Brand, East of Brander Parkway, Dark Hannibal. Um, this is a uh, uh, application for a, a deck to replace an existing deck, but get bigger and, and, and uh, get into the front yard setback. Um, they've been to us now. This is, I think, the third go round. Uh, the first time the deck was exceptionally large. Second time it was a little less large. And now the third time it's a little less large again. Um, you know, the, uh, in some ways, you know, I appreciate their efforts. Uh, you know, for me, um, the, the, my concern, uh, the last go around is how close it was to the driveway. Mm -hmm. And it appears to me to still be very, very close to the driveway. Um, I mean, the, you know, the, the other parts of it have definitely shrunk. Um, and, uh, you folks were all here for the architect's presentation, so I'll, I'll let you all weigh in. I was pleased with the reduction in size, um, but I do agree that it is a little bit close to the parking situation. I agree with that, and I think the only way you can make it where it don't look so close to the parking area and shorten it up by doing away with those steps there putting a handrail up across the whole front of it and just put a small step down in one spot, like a normal deck. Do we know if we take away the steps, does that height require a handrail? I believe so. I, I believe not, but I I'm not certain. I don't think it does. I don't think it would require, think it would require a handrail. Because it's gonna be, you got four, three steps, four rises, that's 32 inches. Yeah, I, don't, I, I I'm not familiar with the exact building code, but uh, I thought it was around 30 inches or less. Okay. I think what I they could were, be wrong. They were going for kind of an open air space um, yeah. instead of having, an, you know, an enclosed porch situation. I think the railing would also make it much more enclosed. And actually, but, having a height there based on the neighbors' comments would actually raise the eye level up and would start to obstruct views but if there's nothing there in the airspace having the steps is actually in my opinion less visually intrusive okay tom uh, i agree that it went small there was a question um we also opened this up to any correspondence as well right mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. and received well we didn't get anything new i right. mean we, but, Just prior, prior, out there. but prior to the hearing we did get you know quite a bit um, a, a, a bunch and and uh, people more or less reiterating their views that they had spread. Had right. spread and that early. was of the original and one and the second time around. Yeah. But this is, and I agree about the handrails as well. Um, without <coughs> with this wide open like that, you're not looking at something, even though you could see through it more or less, there's nothing in, in your line of vision. So I agree with that. Mm -hmm. But it wouldn't stop the view. I mean, the the deck they got there right now got handrails. It does. It does. But that's exactly. not our job to preserve people's right. views, I don't think. No, it's right. not. But I mean, no. it's. It, but that was one. It, they don't, they, they they don't block anybody's right. view. Now, nobody's guaranteed a view. But, you know, also, we, we should, you know, be thoughtful. And, and, yeah. You know, oh, absolutely. In, yeah. In, in, in our application of. of uh, I think there's somebody who said about having more of an open space and. Mm -hmm. and and not having as much visually to be up high. Yeah. Um, I, I personally think I'm very pleased with the reduction in size. Um, I think it's a good, it, it's in a much better place than it was the first time they came to us. Mm -hmm. So what's the consensus here, folks? It's coming down to the nitty gritty. This is this is three, three, three shots at this, and and right. whatever. At this point tonight, I feel like either 
Yeah. Either we approve it or we send it back and when we or we just say no. I don't think that we can uh, continue to say, well, we'd like to see it a little smaller or something like that. This is whatever. I feel satisfied. I'm fine to approve it. I agree. What about you, Tom? As well, I agree. Um, only because they have made changes both times, you know, after the initial denial and, um, you know, considerable changes. It's, um, if, the, if they were coming back to us with the same application or just uh, minor know, minor details, I, I would say it's a definite no, but I, I think they changed it up quite a bit. Yeah. But, you know, they could make it a little lower by having to step out of the house down on the deck. They got it even. Mm -hmm. So you, if you didn't have no handrail, if you drop the deck down, it would make it look smaller too mm -hmm. that one step <clears throat> yeah you know I, thinking about it and looking at it you know i was initially uh inclined to say no because of how close it is again to the driveway right um but i i understand what you all are saying that they have made some conser considerable uh downsizing uh, I, actions here. I also think they were thoughtful in, in keeping that deck on that corner of the house where there was places where it did not need a variance. Right. Yeah. Um, I, I think that's something, you know, it was originally wrapping around the entire front and they got rid of half of that. So I think they did come to a good conclusion and I'm inclined to approve this iteration. It just makes sense how they're squaring it off. Anyone else want to weigh in here? Could you, if you did lower that one step down out of the house, you would lose one step going down. Mm -hmm. That will pull it back away from the road more. Mm -hmm. But they probably want it flush yeah. with the house, right? Just. To right. make the easy out, right? To yeah. Right out the door. Um, all right. I, I mean, I think whatever you all have one meal or something. Um, okay. You know, punch. I understand you may not like this, and you, you, yeah. know, you can say no at the end. Right. Um, yeah. All right. So, are we ready for a checklist mm -hmm. here? All right. Uh, would there be an undesirable change produced in the character of the neighborhood or a detriment to nearby properties? I don't believe so. No, it's it's a deck and there's other houses in the neighborhood with, with decks. Can I get a... Because they did do make it small. What's that? I got to give them credit. They didn't bring it down. The size. Right. A lot. Can I just have one good uh, sentence on the um, character of the neighborhood about the being residential and there being other decks in proximity or? Come on, Lisa. I there mean, are I, other I, words. You just said it beautifully. <laughs> okay, let's write that down then. <laughs> okay, you can go ahead. Um, whether the benefits sought by the applicant be, can be achieved by a feasible alternative to the variance. Um, you know, that I think what, for what they're looking for, this is it, mm -hmm. right? I mean, uh, unless they were going to put in a brick patio down there or something, I, I think that um, you know, there's, there's no real alternative to this that, that would make sense for them, I don't mm -hmm. think. Unless they really went small and just built a tiny deck well, I mean, they could just they didn't build. need to, but that's not going to achieve what they want, right. which is an outdoor deck for use. So we're going to say no to this, right? Okay. Come on, Lynn, give us a sentence. Uh, if I have it, I don't need it from you guys. Um, right, the, <laughs> the, uh, um, no, I mean, I, I, for what they're looking for, I yeah. don't know, you know, other than building a, a brick patio, I don't, I don't see, you know, how else they're going to get the benefit they're looking for. Yeah. Um, whether the requested variance is substantial, I'm going to say it's still substantial. Yeah, yeah, um, I would agree with that. 
Can I get some numbers on, as to why it's substantial? So it is now. Um, <laughs> they need 155 square feet of variance. Um, of relief. Yes. 155 square feet. Yeah. I had 184, but. Oh. Yeah, 155 on this latest site plan. Okay, let's go. I have then. written down uh, 184 also. Let's take a look at that. Let's dive 38% of the deck, 184 square feet. Of That's deck. what I had also. So on the site plan, it shows 155. Uh, that's only that section, I think. I think then you oh, have, I see. And then you you have, have to add yeah, 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 I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Yeah. The step going into the enclosed portion yeah. is separate. Yeah. Then that's so 29. That's, yeah. That is definitely. So what's like our number there? 184. 184 square feet. Okay. Okay. Um, would the variants have an adverse impact on the physical or environmental conditions in the neighborhood? No, I would say no to deck. Okay. Um, with the alleged difficulty was self-created. I'm going to say yes. Yeah. To that. Yes, it is. Yeah. You know, they they could have rebuilt the existing deck in place if if they felt that it was failing. All right. We good on that, everybody. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. So. Um, I'm going to close the work session on that application, and then we're going to get to work on uh, the 14 Wesley Avenue. Any conditions? What's that? Any condition? We're going to have any conditions? I, I can't think of any. I, I, think I so. can't think of anything. Mm -mm. Maybe we should require that there's no handrail. No, because now now they're getting the the thing because they want it wide open. Yeah, but can we can we do that though? Like it shows a handrail going down the steps. Yeah, on this on the on the. You on know, the one. they might maybe they might want to put a handrail for safety eventually if someone has to pull the stairs up. I think that's something yeah, they can. It's a slippery slope. Okay, yeah. all right. We'll stay away from that. Any any other thoughts on any other conditions? No. 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 Okay. All right. Let's move on. Then we're going to move on to uh, uh, our second uh, work session. And that is uh, 14 Wesley Avenue, Chapman and Pfeiffer. Um, that's a, uh, uh, these folks um, have a uh, lot on a corner, ha a house on a corner lot. Um, and they are looking to install a flagstone patio um, with uh, uh, grass in the two inch spaces between the stones. Mm -hmm. um, and um, they, you know, it seems to be thoughtful. It seems to be uh, well planned out. They, they've, uh, you know, worked on uh, 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 drainage. Mm -hmm. and, and for me, I, I think that, uh, uh, you know, we should, as a condition on this, uh, require the drainage that they showed in their plans. Mm -hmm. Yep. Um, no, that was very and, thought out. Yeah. And I would also say that, you know, in the end, they have an outlet that's going to shoot out on the road if if the stuff doesn't go anywhere. I, I think that if if that turns into a problem, um, you know, I, I don't know if we can like, you know, what should I say? It, 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 for the future. it runs there now. Right. right. Mm. Most of the houses run out to this. Right. Right. I mean, they're going to make an effort here, but yeah. I thought maybe, you know, just uh, if, is that if, for us? So I, I, I don't want to worry about that. Yeah. Okay. No. I don't want to worry about that. Yeah. So yeah. I don't think we should get involved. Okay, but we should require the drainage that. They yeah. Have. What they got drawn okay. in, okay. that yeah. they should put it in. Okay. Okay. Yep. Okay. The and the size was uh, minimal too, just to accommodate the whatever furniture. It's fourteen by eighteen. Yeah, it was um, well thought out. I thought. And the best thing, it's got grass and it's absorbed. It's not hard. Concrete, yeah, or anything like that. And the Heights property ownership, they were in support of it. Yeah, there were no neighbor objections. No, you, you know how that works now, right? They said, um, if there's one neighbor objection, then the HPOC is obligated now to object. Oh, really? Oh, really? Yeah. 
Okay. So we had nobody object. Mm -hmm. Only if we think it's credible. Um, okay. <laughs> we're, we're, not, we're not taking comment from the floor, Stella, but thank you. Um, um, all right. So um, anybody want to weigh in on this? I'd like to just get a, a couple people to weigh in and, and give their thoughts. I've been dominating the conversation here. I agree with everything you said, and I thought it was one of the uh, most well thought out and carefully yeah, considered. Posted, posted trial for uh, how to do this, and, and he was great at the meeting, at the meeting mm -hmm. last, right. last month. And I watched the video. It was pretty good. Yeah. Okay, so are we ready to go to <laughs> the work group? Um, whether an undesirable change would be produced in the character of the neighborhood or a detriment to nearby properties? No. 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 And why is that? I think the patio would be in keeping with... Um, Enhancing with what's there. Yeah. yeah. Uh, in keeping with what's in that neighborhood already. Whether well, the benefits sought by the applicant can be achieved by a feasible alternative to the variance. I mean, I guess I mean, you can table out on your wall exactly. and decided not yeah. to do anything. Yeah. I mean, you, you know, because you could, in fact, just, you know, and maybe if we said no to this, maybe that and would be to just put a table out there on the lawn. Um, right. But the other I alternatives would, could have been poor, like it right. could have been a hard surface. Right. 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 So and he's putting that. drainage in, so it's better than what he's got now. Right. So, so he's improving it. So let's answer the question. Whether the benefits sought by the applicant can be achieved by a feasible alternative to the variance? Yes, by not doing anything. But, right. that, no, that's, but, that's, but in that regard, it would be no. Then. Right. 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 Yeah. No. Um, so we're going to say no that mm -hmm. there's... Look, yeah. Whether well, requested variance is substantial. I mean, I would say yes, even though it's not that big, it's still, you know. Um, it's, they need a 25 foot 10. Back from the road. Yeah. I mean, it's, yeah. it's, it's yeah. a substantial, it's a substantial variance. variance. Can we get the measurements on that, Lisa? It's 25, 10. That's the, that's the yes. amount of variance they need? Yes. 25, 10? Yep. All right, would the variants have an adverse impact on the physical or environmental conditions in the neighborhood? I'm going to say no. I think they're, you know, if this drainage thing works out, I think that it right. actually improved mm -hmm. the drainage there. And the, um, okay, I guess that's part of drainage, the soft surface. On the soft surface, yep. Yeah. And uh, with the alleged difficulty with self creating, yes, I mean, it's, they could they have lived with the property there the way it is. Mm -hmm. Yep. Okay, so we're good on that. We're going to close that work session. All right, we have one other thing. To... Oh, we just have to add that condition about the drainage. Okay, right. Sorry about yeah. that. Yeah. You've got to keep that. How is it stated in, in the uh, application about the drainage? Hmm. Um, you're in from patio to trench on eastern border into the new uh, hydrangeas yeah to eastern border so any any runoff will be routed from perimeter drains to water the hydrangeas between the O'Hagan house and ours with any any extra towards Waverly as opposed to pooling behind the hydrangeas as it does now. Okay. All right, anything else for that? Yeah, I think it's good. Is um, that Pfeiffer as well on that one, or is it just Chapman? It's the both. Both. <laughs> Oh, yeah, okay.
Okay, thanks. All right. Uh, next up, we have a discussion. We're going to close that. No, you okay. Yeah, um, we're going to just close that work session. All right. Everybody good? Sure. We don't have to vote on that, I don't think, right? No. Yeah. Um, so we're going to have a quick discussion. Uh, we received uh, um, two appeal requests from Pam Demaris um, concerning uh, walkways to docks. Um, there's no actual thing in the appeal letter saying what they're actually appealing. Um, and so, I, you know, I, I don't see any particular issue that is being appealed here. And my recommendation is that, you know, this, we don't hear this at this point. Um, you know, they can, they are free to come back with something that has some specific items that are to be contested. Mm -hmm. um, but, you know, in the end, uh, right now it's, I don't know, uh, Vague. it's a little bit of a word salad there. And I just, I don't think that there's, that there's no there there for us at this point. And we don't handle docs, no nope. application. The town planning board does, docs and waterway committee, and the town board. It's not our do anything with wetlands. Yep. We don't handle wetland. Does anybody else have anything to chime in on this here, please? No, I just was reading it again. Uh, no, that's fine. No, I'm I'm in support of of that. Of what well, you that just we're not going to hear. It. Anybody else? Can I ask a question? Sure, Albert. Um, didn't the ZBA always hear setbacks, even on wetlands applications? No, no, never, 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 never. never. I, I okay, uh, never. I've been on this board. I mean, that's why I remember a couple when I was on the board. That's yeah, no, there, they were, you know, never. Yeah, no. were heard. One of them was Two Bay Avenue. Yeah, no. You're, no. The, so on Two Bay Avenue, Albert, you know, the, the, um, there, was, there was an issue that the, the folks wanted to extend this garage. No, I remember it. It was he had a rolling skull. Okay. And so we, we didn't want to give him on the road side. And we told him, you can ask the town board for the water side, but that's not us. So there was no, no involvement from our end on the uh, uh, water side on the on the 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 setbacks you know from from the water um we just Not the water but if the side yard setbacks you would hear them yeah, yeah sure if they if, yeah. they, if they, okay. that's that's yeah. that's my question this, yeah this but, but, the one, but side yard setbacks sure you like with, in, with two bay avenue we heard that side i think it's mostly front yard setback um and so you know if if there is a setback issue you know that's that's our domain. Yes. Yes. Okay. That's what okay. that's what I want to. Um, yes. Okay. Um, all right. Anyone else want to weigh in on that? No. No. Okay. May I, uh, may I speak on that, Chairman? No. No. Well. No. It's a work session. It's a work session. It's just for us, ma'am. Um, I just had a question. Did you guys see your website? Yes. Any questions? Have you? Yeah. It's harder. <laughs> it's a little harder to navigate, but we'll get you. Yeah, yes. it's, it's harder. It's a learning curve. But did you find where you to sign in for an email and all of that? Okay. I just sign my email. I just sign in the way I've always okay. signed. Yeah. In. <laughs> um, Definitely harder. Yeah. Um, like I, I, I think that the new website is long overdue, Christina. I think it, it looked so much better than yeah. the old one. Thank you. Um, you know, the, the old one looked like whatever, 2002 or something. And um, so this is whatever. I, progress on that kind of stuff is good. Uh, and, uh, you know, and making things, I think, more accessible to the public is also good. Um, all right. So um, can I have a motion to close the meeting? I'll make a motion. I'll second it. All in favor? Aye. 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 Meeting's closed at what time we got there? 55 a.m.